Ah. So sometimes, like, the mage is being reversed, the magician, um, needs to just understand how he relays his information. Because information is key in this case, in this case, right? So in order to kind of get that girl, you kind of need to plan how you calculate how you relay information. This is like having more of a poker face in the situation and um, being able to kind of like, you know, be able to go in the throes of that situation. Now, the Three of Wands is again, just the Lord of Virtue saying what you're doing in line with what your actions are doing, right? With what your goals are. So, um, this is always just like, always making sure that's aligned, you know? Um, for instance, this could just be, the Three of Wands could just be like, Wait. Wait a second. I'm pretty sure Excuse me. Gemini Aries, um, that keeps coming up just because Gemini Aries are sextiling here, the cards, they sextile these two. Um, so this would just be like this situation and having the answer kind of like almost be helpful. So, um, you know, you're worried about the situation and you want it to improve and kind of like a way to meet people also because you want to meet people. So the three of wands can be teamwork, other people asking other people, kind of always needing help. That three of wands can, um, yeah, asking help, asking someone. Now the chariot is the outcome. So as you do this, as you make sure to have that proper self care in yourself, because like there's a lot about like nurturing your own ambitions, nurturing your own um, passions, like and needing to be able to kind of like articulate that in a way that's more impressive than what you're doing. Because the magus is always about like you want to be impressive, you want to be that that um, that you know that person that can sweep some off their feet. But also that may just being reversed with that three of wands. It's kind of telling you that like, okay, um, the three of wands is like doing what you say. Like you need to have also be able to say it too. You can't just like, you, or no, 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 you need to be able to do it also. You can't just say it. It's not enough to just say it in this case. You need to feel it. It can't just come from like a surface level place. These things really need to come from inside you. Like it really needs to come from like a care taking place, something that you really actively care about. Like your artistry, the chariot upright would always mean like your artistry, something that can get you to and from something. Like basically um, your vehicle would be your artistry, right? And so if you're able to kind of like get everywhere with that, like being able to kind of like uh, perfect that and use that vehicle, to be able to date and be able to kind of be uh, be better at it, you know? Because I feel like there's a lot of like tension built up, like almost like you're scared, like you got anxiety and it's like just toiling for nothing. It's almost like you're kind of like wanting the right thing to say or the right thing to, um, right issue to tackle. But sometimes it's like you kind of need to limit those issues, you know? 
just like focusing on one at a time. So I hope that helps lovely and so let me know if you have any questions. Um, but I hope that helps. Does that make any sense? If you want me to, if you donate or if you subscribe or if you follow, I don't know, um, I can do more readings. Um, but I, I'm also, so like, let's remember, uh, just when you're doing something, you need to, um, uh, when you're saying something, you need to be able to do it also. Um, and that's going to really build your confidence in help finding love. Now, I can look for when. Do you want me to look for when this person might come out? Or you might, you know, find them? Because I can do that. But other than that, let's do some new moon readings. Do you guys want me to do some new moon readings for you? Do you want, um... Guys, want some new moon readings? Am I going to find love? Did you know? Okay, wait. Did you know the number one curiosity of a Scorpio is how they come across to other people? That's like they're always their one desire. They want to know, like, okay, well, what do they think of me? You know? Well, like, well, what do they, you know, it's like wanting to, like, experience, like, yourself because, like, you're really curious. It's not like a it's kind of like, and you worked really hard on yourself and you're always really aware of things. So it's like kind of hard for you to like get out of that and to understand and kind of like get into other people's shoes. So that, uh, yeah, <laughs> I, just, I just have to be like, yeah, that's definitely um, a Scorpio thing. Cause like sometimes like, uh, I think that the, cause the Magus, when the Magus is reversed, it's just like coming off with like false pretenses almost that you have your own agenda like you like not just your own agenda but it's like people like people are like well he doesn't even seem interested in me he clearly just wants to you know figure this out or you know or he just wants to see this about me you know so it can be like that you know where it's like people like they they want to get to the gritty nitty, you know? They want to understand, like they want the raw truth. They want to strip those layers away. They don't want to like have it so like cut and dry like, what did you say? And I said this, oh, and I can't believe that. But you have to be like raw, like, ah, oh. like you have to be like, fuck, you know, I don't know. I don't know, I'm like a terrible actor. Fuck, as I look at the camera, I'm like, am I doing it right? Am I doing it right? Am I, is my hair right? Is my hair right? I can't rest my hair. <laughs> okay. But don't worry. I get crap too. I'm a Leo moon. Um, and it, like the number one thing that people say about Leos is that they won't tell you their age. And I won't tell you my age. It's 24. Leo moons, you know, it's kind of funny. Like if you get that out of a Leo moon, it's kind of like impressive. It's like, you know, you got their age. Bitch, you got their age? And so that's why I'm really apprehensive about asking people their birth chart because I'm like, well, they're gonna, fuck, they're gonna fucking bitch slap me because I'm like seeing my life through my own lenses. I'm seeing other people through my own lens, you know? And so I'm like thinking, I'm like, oh, well, fuck, they're gonna get pissed if I ask them their birth chart. I can't stay up anymore. That's okay. Go to bed, girl. That's okay, girl. If you need me, just message me on Discord. Oh. But thank you for coming, girl. And, like, I seriously, um, thank you, Royal. And I won't always, like, go on a rant about how great you are. You know, I'll just be more real and just, like, ask you how you're doing, you know. Instead of, you know, because you are really fucking great. 
and I do know that, you know. But have a good night, Royal, and thank you for joining. I need to actually end the stream pretty soon. So we'll let's let's look into this though. But thank you, Royal. Thank you, Royal, for coming and have a good night, girl. Seriously, thank you. Mwah. I don't I hope that's not creepy. But kisses if you want them. I don't know if that I wouldn't do that in real life, you know. I wouldn't kiss you in real life. Just because, like, growing up, we didn't really hug as a family. That's why I love doing tarot readings online. Because I, uh, I have... Anyways. I told you. You guys are going to get to know every little detail about me. Every dark crevice I'm going to reveal. Okay, now let's look at next year. Will 2020 be a good year for Lonely and so? Well, no, I pulled the Three of Wands reversed. Again, problems with like how you come across to people. Like almost like doing things under the surface. Like kind of like... Um, I'm gonna pull again. Okay, let's look for. Cause I said I asked for 2020, to see if 2020 was gonna be a year, good year. I don't, and I'm not trying to give you the slip. I'm not trying to, you know, make you go like. I'm not saying that you're not gonna have anything. I'm just gonna say you might not. It's not gonna be what you like, basically. I had the three of wands reversed. The three of wands is just denoting saying one thing and not doing it. It's almost like cheating on someone, you know? So that's bad. And then I had the king of discs reversed. That's like not following the rules, like obstructing, like obstruction, justice. <laughs> obstruction of justice, okay. But I'm um, like, you know, just like doing like things. I don't think you shouldn't. Um, but. Yeah, I really need to end. I need to end. Okay. Because everyone's getting off. Yeah, we just need to Okay, let's just draw this and then we'll 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 you know, like we'll we'll call it. Okay. But have a good night, Royal.